All right, everyone, it's Brandon again, talking about Chrome OS Flex again. Now, one of the best things about this channel is when you guys teach me something I didn't know about Chrome OS Flex, because if you might know from watching my videos, I never even used Chrome OS anything until just a few weeks ago when I started uploading videos about it. But uh, check out this comment I got here from Zarin talking about when things don't work, there's actually a way to check the uh, CPU and memory usage on Chrome OS. I had no idea. So this was an awesome uh, tip for me. So you just open up your doc, your launcher and type diagnostics. And there's a diagnostics app that I didn't even know existed. And here you can see your CPU usage and your RAM usage. Now, one thing that surprised me, um, if you saw my video just a day or so ago about uh, Chrome OS Flex versus um, Zorin OS Core, not even the light one, I uh, looked at how much memory was used by Zorin OS from a cold boot, and it was about 1. maybe 1.3 gigs. Um, Chrome OS Flex actually uses more memory than Zorin OS. Now here they tell you uh, the memory available instead of how much is being used, but right when I booted it, this is going to be deceptive because I got the camera running and I got the other thing running. But right when I booted it up, it, the RAM usage was 1.4 gigabytes, and I'll have to, I'd have to go back and look at the Zorin video, but I think Chrome OS Flex actually uses more RAM than the Zorin OS, not even the light edition. So that surprised me. But anyway, this is something I wanted to show you guys, because I thought it was really cool, and maybe everybody you know already knew about it, except for me, but now I know about it, and hopefully now you know about it. So just open your settings, open up your diagnostics, and... Um, yeah, you can see some cool information about your uh, setup here. So I thought this was really neat. Wanted to share it with everybody. And now you can see exactly what I'm dealing with here on this laptop. Uh, Celeron only got two cores on this thing, but uh, it runs Chrome OS Flex fine. So, yeah, there's a CPU test. I have no idea what that does. I'm not going to do it. So, anyway, thank you to Zarin for the tip I hope I said your name right and yeah if you guys have other tips please let me know and we can share them with everybody the more we all know the better we all are so I want to thank you all for watching the video and uh, let me know what else you want me to check out subscribe to the channel if you want to and other than that have a good day bye now